zoom, 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 boom, 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 boom. Here he comes, that mighty mouse, coming to vanquish the foe with a mighty blow. So don't be afraid anymore, cause things won't be like they've been before. Here I come to save the day. Thank goodness, mighty mouse is on his way. So let the trumpet players play. For Mighty Mouse is here today. Here he comes, that Mighty Mouse, just like a bolt from the blue, with a heart that's true, fighting evil, fighting crime, and always there in the nick of time. Here he comes to save the day, and he will prove that crime will never pay. So let the trumpet players play. For Mighty Mouse is here today. Twitch. Hey, hop on your tongue. Hop on your tongue. Have some fun. Have some fun. Number one, number one. You're number one. Twitch and ride. Twitch and ride. Watch me ride. Hey! show up tonight when Elway and his pals give a benefit concert for the Mouseville Orphanage. Oh boy! Elway and the Tree Weasels! They're my heroes! I'm gonna get my tickets right now! Tree Weasels concert sold out? Gosh! Now I'll never have any fun! Here I come to save the day! Well, well, why the long face, little pal? Gee whiz and goshy willikers, I wanted to see Elwee and the Tree Weasels, but the show sold out. I'll tell you what, I know their manager, Sandy Bottomfeeder. Let's go meet the Tree Weasels in person. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> well, if you don't want to go, I'll understand. No, no, I want to go so bad I can taste it. Well, then, let's hop along, Cassidy. <laughs> Boys, remember, this is a romantic ballad, so speed it up. Why don't we take a break, Sandy? Well, I don't know, boys. We've got a big night ahead of us. Look, guys, it's my old top sergeant, Mighty Mouse. Sandy, you old coon dog, you. Give me the old secret handshake of the water weasels. Ack, ack, attack! <laughs> oh, you remembered. Say, who's your little ah! compadre there? My name's Scrappy, and keep your hairless mitts to yourself. Now, Scrappy, is that nice? Ah, that's okay. I get that stuff from the boys all the time. The boys! Hey, you'll want to meet them. Hey, Elwee. Elwee? Elwee! Hey, man, anything you say, okay? Okay, boys, shake hands with my new little friend here, Scrappy. I'd like you to meet my boys. This is Elwee. He's the mischievous one. Scrappy is your biggest fan. And this is Thicky. You'll like him. He's really fat. Say, where's... Oh, there you are. Gooby, come out of there. 
Don't mind Kirby. Oh. He's the shy, sensitive type. Well, little guy, how would you like two free tickets to see the Tree Weasels perform tonight? Yay! Well, Scrappy, what do you think of Sandy now? Oh, gee, Mighty, he's great. But, uh, well, I got a question. What does he have to do with the Tree Weasels? I mean, <laughs> he's not their pop, is he? You know, I've often wondered about that myself. Kids, I'm Mashy the Pop. You won't believe today's incredible story. Sandy Bottom Feeder was a young man who was depressed. Gosh, I'm depressed. Depressed because he didn't have a family. Gosh, I wish I had a family. It was at that moment that fate laid its hand. Rapture, my own little family. Let's go home, my loved ones. I'll make you happy. And that was the day that Sandy met the tree weasels. I'll raise you as normal children. I promise to love you more than anything. But boys, you must do something for me. Anything you say, man. Just take it easy. Keep cool, man. I want you to wear these clothes for me. It's okay, man. Just do what he says. Don't make any sudden moves. <laughs> There's something else. Anything, man. Sure, anything, man. Oh, anything. I want you to sing. La, 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 la. And I want you to sing really fast. La, 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 la. And I want you to sing backwards. Gradually, Sandy realized how gifted his progeny were and allowed them to display their talents. Hey! And soon the success of Elwee and the Tree Weasels was assured. But they never forgot those less fortunate than themselves, such as the orphans of Mouseville, who are being honored in tonight's concert. And now, on with the show! Thank you, citizens of Mouseville. As you know, this concert is a benefit for the Mouseville Orphanage. Well, at the end of the show, Elwee and the Tree Weasels will have a special surprise for all the orphans. The boys have used tonight's proceeds to secure brand new parents for each and every one of you. And now, here they are, Elwee and the Tree Weasels! Elwee? Elwee! Oh, uh, thank you. What's this? Dear Elwee and the Weasels, plane carrying parents caught in thunderstorm. Stop. Has lost contact with tower. Stop. Signed, short stop. The parents plane lost. Oh, that's terrible. Sandy, what's wrong? The plane. <laughs> With the parents. Out of control. Uh, call my agent. Where's the parents that are supposed to be on this flight? 
Oh, we didn't think you'd mind. We were running low on peril, so we switched your order. Darn. <laughs> It's almost over, and no parents. Oh, the poor, poor kids. And now, kids, the moment you've been waiting for. Well, folks, I'm afraid I've got some bad news. It seems that... Orphans of Mouseville, your new parents are here! Come on down! This great voice. It just goes to show it's not the species that makes a family work, it's love. Right, boys? Anything you say, man. Sure, just keep it cool. And that's the story of Elwee and the Tree Weasels. Incredible, isn't it? Oh, and don't forget, always look both ways before crossing the street. <laughs> <laughs> leisurely lunch hour after a hard morning of work. Mike! Mike, hey, Mike! Hi, Scrappy, what's up? <sighs> Mike, look, look! I just got my Cosmic Mr. Magic a Crime Buster ring! Now I'm a member of the Cosmic Mr. Magic a Crime Busting League! Now I can fight criminals just like my heroes! Mmm. Dick Detective, Murray the Barbarian, really weird tales from outer space. Well, let's see what this ring can do. You? What comic strip are you? I'm not a comic strip. I'm Scrappy. <laughs> uh, reminds me of the brain bats from Series 5. Forget them. Let's hit this town. We'll get a secret hideout and terrorize the populace. <laughs> Or maybe even Mouseville. You stay here. I'll find help. Stand around. That's what he wants. Nobody knows what he meant. What's up? What's up? What's up? I don't know. What are we doing? Yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, something terrible has just happened. The king has burst in the flames. This is the worst disaster in human memory. Oh, the humanity of it. 
Hello, information? I'm looking for the secret hideout of the Funny Papers gang. Yes, I think it's a new listing. The old deserted gumball factory, eh? Thanks. Here I come to save the day! <laughs> now, my faithful minions, I will explain our plan for the benefit of the audience. We will cover these gumballs with our mind control coating. Mouseville will be ours for the taking. <laughs> Hate to burst your bubble, Kingpin, but you're all chewed up. It's Mighty Mouse. Get him! Have some gum, Mighty Mouse. Why, thank you, woman cat. <laughs> That's a leg, Mother Bell. Subdue that rodent. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to you, Mighty Mouse. This is one time you were not saved by the bell. <laughs> you know what to do with him, boys. Right, Kingpin! Now, Mighty Mouse, you will have 15 minutes to solve the puzzle. Otherwise, you will be turned into a chewy, gummy treat. And not only that, kids, but the flavor lasts for hours. <laughs> I'll see you in the funny papers, Mighty Mouse. <laughs> Goodbye forever. I used to be pretty good at word games. M I T M I T uh, Mighty uh, Mouse Mighty Mouse. Hey, that's me. Oh, let's see. Mighty Mouse S A B L M Z. Mighty Mouse is a. Uh, it's right on the tip of my tongue. Mighty Mouse is a. a Santa's little helper. No, Mighty Mouse is a. a wimp, you fool! Wimp! Mighty Mouse is a wimp! I knew the answer all along, Blockhead. I was merely waiting for you to lower your guard. Now to put you back where you belong. I was right. By reversing the polarity on the Misto Magical Crime Busters ring, I was able to trap the evildoer in the stasis field. Now to round up the rest of the gang before they turn the people of Mouseville into slobbering couch potatoes. Here you go, kid. We have free samples today. <laughs> Don't touch that gum if you value your mind, little fellow. Curses! It's Mighty Mouse! Head cheese! Protect me! I eat guys like you for lunch, head cheese! Oh no! Spare me! Well, that's that. What could that be? All right, who's in charge here? Gosh, you're huge. Yes, I am. I am huge, the conqueror. Feel my wrath, Muddy Mouse. Behold the mystical power of my magic hammer. Now, please excuse me while I wreak my vengeance. Looks like I can cancel that vacation to Miami Beach. This is such wonderful therapy. Oh, I will give you such a pinch. It is useless to resist me. With my magic hammer, I can turn you into anything I wish. Be 
please, please, let me out. Let me out. No, oh, had enough, huh? Please, it smells like onions in here. Please, put me in the ring where I may be with others of my own kind. Move over, Bloodhead. Oops, excuse me. Hold on. Phew, I hope that's it. Howdy, people of Earth. I am of a superior grade of intelligence. Sorry, partner. This planet ain't big enough for the two of us. It's Mighty Mouse. As you can see, this fluid has life-draining qualities. Soon you will be powerless against me. If you're so smart, Mr. Brain, see if you can solve this puzzle. Hmm. Mighty Mouse is a wimp, but what does it mean? It means you made me mad, you extraterrestrial smart aleck. <laughs> that was dirty pool, son. You just hit my medulla oblongata. <clears throat> my cerebral cortex. Mother! Welcome to Amboy 4. We are pleased to have your puny planet participate in our intergalactic livestock show and demolition derby. Let the games begin! Just who do they think you are? with my world, bub! It's back to the funny papers for you, Buster! Gee, my lunch must be stone cold by now. Mike, you're back! What happened? Uh, Mighty Mouse came to the rescue and everything's okay. But what about the villains? They're right in here. Mike? Where have you been? You've been gone for two hours. Say, what a nice ring. May I see it? Uh, but Pearl, I don't think you should... Well, if you don't want me to wear it, just say so. Be quiet. We're trying to sleep, you fillies. <laughs> 